Come how to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here. Well, what we have here, this follows what we have a times a. This can be written as a squared. But this same thing multiplying, you can write this as 5 raised to the power x or squared then equals to 40 from here. The next step here, this follows when we have a raised to the power m raised to the power n. This same thing as a raised to the power m n. That is, this power multiplies, and we have 5 raised to the power 2x equals to 40 from here. The next step here, we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log 5 raised to the power 2x equals to log 40 from here. Then here, we apply the power of logarithm. When we have log m raised to the power p. This same thing as p log m. That is, yeah, this becomes 2x log 5 equals to log 40 from here. The next step here, we divide both sides by log 5. That is, divide this side by log 5. Also, divide this side by log 5, which implies here log 5 cancel each other. And we have 2x left, which is equals to log 40 over log 5. The next step here, we can write 40 as 5 times 8. That is, yeah, this becomes 2x equals to log 5 times 8 over log 5. Then, also from here, this follows what we have log a times b, which is the same thing as log a plus log b. That is, yeah, what we have becomes 2x equals to log 5 plus log 8 over log 5. Then, we separate this into two fractions and we have 2x equals to log 5 over log 5 plus log 8 over log 5. That is here, we have log 5 cancel each other and one left here, which implies 2x equals to 1 plus log 8 over log 5. Then, also here, we can write it as 2 times 2 times 2, which is 2 raised to the power 3. That is, what we have here becomes 2x equals to 1 plus log 2 raised to the power 3 over log 5. Then, from here, we apply the power of logarithm. 3 comes here, and all we have becomes 2x equals to 1 plus 3 log 2 over log 5. Then, also from here, we apply change of base from when we have log a over log b. This is the same thing as log a to base b. That is, yeah, what we have becomes 2x equals to 1 plus 3 log 2 base 5. Then from here, we divide both sides by 2. That is, divide this side by 2, also divide this side by 2. Yeah, 2 cancel each other. We are left with x, which is equals to 1 plus 3 log 2 base 5. All over 2. So here we have the value of x in this problem as 1 plus 3 log 2 base 5 all over 2. Then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem. That is, we substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to 1 plus 3 log 
2 base 5 all over 2. Then what we have here becomes 5 raised to power 1 plus 3 log 2 base 5 over 2 times also 5 raised to power 1 plus 3 log 2 base 5 over 2. Is this equals to 40 on this side? That is, here we have same base multiplying follows and we have a raised to power m times a raised to power also same power that is m this same thing as a raised to power m plus m which is 2m that is here also we can write it as 5 raised to power 2 times 1 plus 3 log 2 base 5 all over 2 is it equals to 40 on this side then here this power multiplies and two here cancel each other and we have 5 raised to power 1 plus 3 log 2 base 5 is it equals to 40 on this side that is here we apply the law of indices now we have a raised to power m plus n this same thing as a raised to power m times a raised to power n then this becomes 5 raised to power 1 times 5 raised to power 3 log 2 is 5. Is it equals to 40 on this side? And 5 raised to power 1, same thing as 5, then times here yeah, we reverse this 3 hope from power law. At this one we have P log M. This same thing as log M raised to power P. And we have 5 raised to power log 2 raised to power 3 is 5. Is it equals to 40 on this side? Then this becomes 5 times 5 raised to power log 2 raised to power 3 as 8 is 5. Is it equals to 40 on this side? Then this follows when we have a raised to power log b to base a which is equals to b then here the same thing as 8 we have 5 times 8 is it equals to 40 here of course 5 times 8 here gave us 40 which is equals to 40 on this side then we have the left hand side equals to the right hand side and therefore we conclude that x equals to 1 plus 3 log 2 base 5 all over 2 satisfies this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget the steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on. Share this video, give it a thumbs up, and put your comment. See you next class and bye for now.